Praxis Prepper. Hey everybody, this is Praxis. This video is for an audience of one person, but it might have interest to other people, but it's kind of a private video, so, uh, you know, if you aren't Dutch Courage, you have absolutely no business watching this video, but you might be interested in what I'm about to say anyway. I thought I'd do this video right now because uh, ahead of a large New England storm that's supposed to be in our area in the next 24 to 48 hours, our power just inexplicably went off for no reason. I'm not sure why it went off, uh, but I can't do any edit work or any of my usual kind of work, so I figured now would be a great time to do this video. And this video is about uh, this book, Seed to Seed. I did a video on it recently, and I was asked to, uh, I was asked a question by Dutch Courage uh, about what specific seeds are in this book that, you know, there's information about how you can propagate those seeds, collect them, and everything. Because, uh, I mean, it's, it's a little vague, just seed to seed, and he wanted to know exactly what seeds that involves. So uh, I'm going to go through the book uh, index in the back and let you know what are all the seeds that you can learn how to save if you uh, buy a copy of Seed to Seed. I'll put a copy, a, a link down to the book if you're interested down in the description below. Uh, and the book that I'm reading from is the 1991 version. I think that that's still the, the current version at the moment. I don't think they've revised it since. There's been no new news on how to save basil seeds or anything like that. Uh, so uh, that's what I'm reading from. So here we go. Uh, I'll just read it while my my dinner cooks over the wood stove here uh, <coughs> and these are all alphabetically the different types of seeds that you can oh my god I don't even I don't know how to pronounce the first one Acholecha A-C-H-O-E-C-H-A I don't know I, I, I'm sure they won't be all that bad Adzuki beans African horned cucumber Ahipa A-H-I-P-A okay uh, Amaranth Armenian cucumber, artichoke uh, of the Chinese var variety, and also artichoke of the globe variety, and Jerusalem artichokes. Also, Asian pickling melon, asparagus, asparagus bean, asparagus pea, balsam apple, balsam pear, basil, azuki beans, uh, asparagus beans, broad beans, butter beans, cluster beans, common beans, fava beans, hyacinth beans, jack beans, lima beans, moth beans, mung beans, popping beans, potato beans, rice beans, runner beans, soybeans, sword beans, uh, tep tepary beans, T-E-P-A-R-Y beans, uh, winged beans, yam bean, and yard long bean. Those are all the beans. Um, we've also got beets, um, mango beets, sugar beets, uh, beet berry, bitter melon, black mustard, black salsify, broad bean, broccoli, broccoli rob, uh, broom corn, Brussels sprouts, burr cucumber, butter bean, cabbage, uh, Chinese cabbage, I don't know how to pronounce, kaihua, C-A-I-H-U-A, that's in here, uh, calabazia, uh, C-A-L-A-B-A-Z-I-L-L-A, -L -L -A, Calabazia, I'm not sure. Uh, cantaloupe, Cape Gooseberry, Cardoon, Carrot, carrot uh, Peruvian Carrot, uh, Cassaba, uh, Casa Banana, Casa Banana, I'm not sure about that, but it's spelled just like it sounds. Cauliflower, uh, Celeriac, Celery, uh, Celtus, C-E-L-T-U-C-E, -E. uh, uh, Coyote, C H A Y O T E, Chayote, I don't know. Uh, Cheverel, C H E R V I L. Uh, also, a turnip rooted variety of that Cheverel, or whatever it is. Uh, chickpea, chicory, uh, ch but there are a lot of seeds here I don't know how to pronounce. Uh, Chilla Coyote, C H I L A C A Y O T E, okay. Chili, Chinese artichoke, Chinese cabbage, Chinese chives, Chinese lantern, Chinese mustard, and chives. Uh, uh, citron, cluster bean, coxcomb, collards, coriander, corn, corn salad of the common variety, and corn salad of the Italian variety. That's racist. Uh, cucumber, cowpea, cucumber of the African horn variety, and cucumber of the Armenian variety. Uh, burr cucumber also, and currant tomato. Devil's Claw, dill, eggplant, eggplant uh, of the tomato fruited variety, endive, escarole, is that how you pronounce that? Escaroli, fava bean, uh, fennel, garbanzo beans, which is the same as chickpeas, it's a little redundant. Uh, garden crest, garden, garden huckleberry, garlic, garlic chives, globe artichokes, gobo, G-O-B-O, -O, 
Uh, good King Henry. It sounds like more like a person than a seed. <laughs> okay. uh, a hard shelled gourd, Malabar gourd, serpent gourd, wax gourd, black graham and green graham, ground cherry, honeydew, horseradish, husk tomato, hyacinth bean, Indian mustard, jack bean, Japanese bunching onion, Japanese burdock, jelly melon, Jerusalem artichoke, which I already mentioned earlier. Uh, there might be some redundancy in here. Maybe they're listing them with different common names. Uh, Jicama, J-I-C-A-M-A, uh, kale, sea kale, Siber Siberian kale, kohlrabi, lamb's quarters, which lamb's quarters just seeds itself in my opinion, leek, lentil, lettuce, lima bean, angled lufa, smooth lufa, I'm not sure if that's right, L-U-F-F-A, maca, malabar gourd, malabar spinach, mangle, M-A-N-G-E-L, uh, mango melon, uh, musk melon, Asian pickling melon, cantaloupe melon, cassava melon, honeydew melon, pocket melon, snake melon, winter le melon, and miner's lettuce. Also, moth bean, mountain spinach, multiplier onion, mung bean, musk melon, mustard greens, mustard, uh, black mustard, Chinese mustard, Indian mustard, white flowered mustard, and n narangia, N-A-R-A-N-J-I-L-L-A. Uh, New Zealand spinach, uh, common nightshade, isn't that poisonous? Why would you want to propagate that? Uh, well, some, not all nightshade is poisonous. In fact, tomatoes, potatoes, uh, lots of things we eat are, are nightshade family. But nightshade itself, the, the thing that's commonly known as nightshade, poisonous, as far as I know. Uh, Nunas, N-U-N-A-S, okra, uh, common onion, Japanese bunching onion, multiplier onion, potato onion, top setting onion, uh, auric, or O R A C H, parsley, parsley root. Okay, we're 66% uh, done here. Parsnip, pea, uh, asparagus, pea, edible potted pea, peanut, uh, pepino, uh, P E P I N O, uh, pepper, uh, peria, P E R I L L A, uh, Peruvian carrot, pigeon pea, pocket melon, poha, poisonberry, popping bean, poisonberry. Should I take that literally? Uh, potato bean, uh, potato, uh, potato onion, uh, pumpkin also, uh, another type of squash, uh, purslane, quail grass, quinoa, radish, uh, oh god, rape, R-A-P-E, that's a thing, I guess, I guess, whatever, <laughs> rhubarb, uh, rice bean, uh, rocamboli, R-O-C-A-M-B-O-L-E, I don't know, uh, rocket, or in French, roquet, it says in here, uh, roselle, runner bean, rutabaga, salsify, black salsify, wild salsify, scorzonera, I think I said that correctly, sea kale, which I think I mentioned earlier under the kales, serpent gourd, shallot, shungiku, uh, S-H-U-N-G-I-K-U, uh, Siberian kale, skirret, snake melon, sorghum, French sorrel, garden sorrel, mountain sorrel, soybeans, spinach, Malabar spinach, mountain spinach, New Zealand spinach, which I know I mentioned earlier, squash, strawberry tomato, sugar beet, sunberry, sunflower, edible rooted sunflower, sunroot, sweet, uh, I'm sorry, sweet turnip, sweet potato, Swiss chard, sword bean, tamarillo, uh, tarwi, T-A-R-W-I, uh, tepary bean, tomatillo, tomato, currant tomato, husk tomato, tomato fruited eggplant, top setting onion, tree tomato, that's interesting, turnip, uluco, U-L-L-U-C-O, unicorn plant, that's interesting, I think I'd like to grow <laughs> a unicorn plant, uh, vegetable pear, vine peach, uh, vine pomegranate, water, Convolvulus, convolvulus, C-O-N-V-O-L-V-U-L-U-S. Uh, water spinach, watercress, large leaf watercress, watermelon, wax gourd, West Indian gherkin, white flowered mustard, winged bean, winter melon, witloof chicory, wonderberry, yakon, yam beet, uh, Y-A-C-O-N on that last one, yakon. Uh, and yard-long bean. Literally? A yard-long bean? 
We'll see about that. So if you are interested in uh, seed to seed, those are the uh, specific varieties that are available in here uh, for, for you to get specific knowledge on. But a lot of those things like, you know, squashes are all going to be kind of similar to each other. You know, a lot of these things are going to be kind of similar. Um, but if you wanted an exhaustive list of what's in seed to seed, that's it for you. So if you're interested in the book still after that and it's got some stuff that you'd be interested in, I'll throw a link down below. I hope you guys found that useful. I, you know, it is a good question because, you know, you buy things just hoping that it'll have something useful to you in there and maybe it wouldn't. I can't think of anything off the top of my head that wasn't in there, but, you know, who knows. That's it. Thanks for watching. I think my dinner's going to be ready pretty soon. This episode has been brought to you in part by Prescott Caliber Club and Jeske Defense Strategies. Prescott Caliber Club is a federally licensed firearm manufacturer and retail store specializing in firearms, survival gear, and producing great online content. If you want to thank them for supporting this channel, go check them out at prescottcalclub.com. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.